how to get more listings. Hi, I'm Paul R. Atkinson, your real estate coach. Today, we're going to talk about how to get more listings. You know, it's interesting, right? How do you get more listings? First of all, you need to get a listing. All right, I'm going to talk to you about that in depth. I'm going to show you a few things that you need to know and that you can use to get more listings and cause a domino effect. Before we do that, hit that subscribe button. Also go down. Yeah, go down into the description of this video and look for the links that will help you to do this. Next thing you want to do is be sure to give me a comment. Give me some feedback. Let me know what you'd like to see or let me know what you'd like me to expand upon. Right. Because we're here right now just for a few minutes just to provide you the information and what you need to know to increase your business, right? You want to increase your business. How do we get more listings? That's the topic today, right? All right. I'm going to tell you how, first of all, you need a listing in order to get more listing. But the good news is the listing doesn't have to be yours. It could be another agent's listing in your office or, you know, right now the, the environment is kind of relaxed. Some real estate brokerage firms are having other real realtors from other real estate brokerage firms do open houses on their listing. So it's pretty cool. Most areas are like that. Just get a listing that you like. My ideal situation and recommendation to you would be perhaps get in a listing or a couple of listing open houses inside of your farm area. Now, when you go on that open house, this is the key. This is the ticket. Write this down. Go in the description box below and click on the link right now. I'm going to wait for you. Okay. All right. Now write this down, get a pen and paper to get more listings. Number one, you need to have a listing. When you have the listing, whether it's yours or it's not, it's okay. You're going to do what is called the P5. The P5 gets you more listings. It gets you more buyers. Click on the link below, go in the description box at the end of this video, or now you want to cut to the chase, go right now. The P5 allows you the ability to knock on five more doors, at least minimum. And there's a script and a technique how to do this how to speak to that seller, how to speak to that potential seller, how to speak to that homeowner, or it could be sometimes some people renting. I've had that before too, but I've even had the ability to and the tenacity like a bulldog to get in there and get that, that tenant to get me the, <laughs> the landlord's number, call the landlord. Boom. It happened. You know, it's like 16 years. So I kind of seen a lot of stuff. It doesn't happen often, but I've been there. I've seen it. So I have the experience in it. So when you do that, it's going to allow you, when you make these engagements with the sellers, it allows you to get more opportunities to list. It also brands you for that community. That's why I said, do it in the farm area or close to where you live. Work that farm area in this way, hit the ground running, doing these things the way I'm telling you. And if you do it consistently and persistently, with drive, dedication, and self-motivation, this is the formula. Those are, it's like making a soup, a really good soup. That's it. Drive, dedication, and self-motivation. You will succeed at getting many, many listings. The year goes out, you'll have 17 listings, 18, 20, 25, 40. I remember one time I had like 122 listings. <sighs> Well, there was a subdivision. I had a whole subdivision. So, you know, a part of it. So nothing to brag about. I'm not here to show off. I am only validated in my mind and letting you know what I have achieved in 16 years. 122 listings, 44. And normally at one time, I usually just carry 44, 44 all the time, that 40 number. But I can remember the most is probably like 120. And, you know, it's so you could do it. That's the point. I'm just here to to motivate and to let you know you're not the only one. If I did it and I'm doing it, you can do it. It's possible. It is a reality. Okay. You could do it. Go in the description box below on this video, click on the link, find out more of how you can get more listings, how you could do the P5, how you could, that's the Paul five. Remember that, how you could do that P5, 
how you can get out there and get engaged, what scripts to use, what to say, how to feel, how to make yourself comfortable, how to be natural at it. There's a technique, there's a way to do it. Look below and you could see that. Most important in getting more listings, you have to engage with the sellers, the community. You have to engage. And engaging means personally, physically. It also means mailing out. Mail out. Mm -hmm. Yep, if you have, a, it's all in your budget. You're a business owner, don't forget that. So when you have a business, you create a budget. And that's how you operate, because you're a business owner. So if your budget has, you know, maybe $50 a month, it's okay. Start with $50 a month. If it has $500 a month, there you go. $5,000 a month, $20,000 a month. Yeah, don't worry. It, when you're making X amount, $20,000 a month in your budget is okay. Trust me, it's not no big, it's like 50 cents, okay? To a, just don't worry about it. You'll see it. it, it'll happen. Just be persistent and know that have a budget and whatever the budget is, work that budget to have that mail out campaign minimum of six months 12 months is ideal 12 months is better but six months definitely the mail out goes out it's all that one page flyer that talks about why use you it says why use paul r atkinson why use paul atkinson why paul r atkinson why you why you to list that house Look inside the description box below. Find that link to get that one page flyer draft on how to present yourself to a seller in one page. That is the ticket to get them to say, whoa, it's not overwhelming. It's just a quick introduction, but a powerful introduction. I've used it so many times, mailed out, mail out, mail out, door knocking, door knocking, door knocking. Asking people, asking people, asking people. It works. Show you how. Click on the links below. Now, one finally, let's just wrap this up real quick. Uh, I do have to go. I know you have to go too. We're always busy. But when you want to get more listings, you have to make sure that you are following those simple steps of getting on a listing, doing an open house, making sure you're doing some door knocking, making sure that you are also mailing out. And most importantly, you ask for the listing. And it goes a little something like this. Who do you know? You ask, who do you know wants to sell real estate, buy real estate, or rent real estate? So when you ask that question to everyone you see and you wear your name badge and everywhere you go, you'll get a listing as well. So these are the things that I want to tell you about. There's more to it. Go in the description box below. Be sure to also hit the subscribe button. Until next time, I will see you soon. It's always a pleasure. You know how I feel about you, realtor. I love real estate agents. I love realtors. I love to see you what? Increase, make more, grow, develop your family. See you again. Go get them, tiger.